Hey guys, Elegant Mess again from the Mad Dog Gaming Clan. Today we're going to do a uh, little overview Sony Vio F series. Uh, do a little bit of gameplay, see how she performs uh, Battlefield 3, uh, Tom Clancy Ghost Recon Future Soldier, uh, Modern Warfare 3, a couple of things just to see how she performs and uh, let everybody take a look. So, I'll get you in a little closer look here. Start off with some Battlefield 3, see how it performs. I also have open hardware monitor open. Um, that way, keep an eye on temperatures, things like that. See how everything's doing. Surprisingly, for a uh, for a gaming professional series laptop, it uh, it runs pretty cool. Uh, if you do see one of the other videos, I went through and redid the uh, thermal paste application on the processor and the graphics card, and that uh, that helped with the cooling quite significantly. Now before I started uh, building my, my desktop, uh, I used to have this set up with a uh, USB hub with a keyboard and mouse and then hooked up to an external monitor and performs very nicely. Run a little uh, salt class with a shotgun, see how we do. So uh, let's deploy in here and uh, see how she does. I'm full on six. Oh, he got me. Three torn. Oh yeah. And the. Uh, the laptop cooler is by Thermaltake. It has a 240mm uh, fan with the blue LED on it. Performs pretty nicely. <laughs> Even when I did, I usually uh, usually had it hooked up with a keyboard and mouse. Pretty tight server, lots of action going, and uh, it, it performs pretty nicely. I actually haven't checked the, uh, the video settings to see what they're set at. Um, 
after running that for a little bit, it was up to uh, six, the GPU was up to 64 degrees C, which really isn't bad at all. Uh, processor max was 70, 70 degrees C on the uh, Intel Core i7. again after so long not playing it.
Enemy UAV spotted. Friendly Predator missile inbound. Recon, future soldier. Okay, so here we got a little bit of uh, Ghost Recon, future soldier. Time we got up to 66 degrees C, which again is not bad at all. So yeah, I hope you liked it. If you have any questions, uh, please feel free to leave comments, subscribe, requests. Thanks again.